Welcome, my name is Zuki. I met you previously in Violet City. In order to bring back Lugia, we needed someone with the right bond with Pokemon. We asked Mr. Pokemon to give this mystery egg to whoever showed true potential. The egg was eventually handed from Mr. Pokemon to Professor Elm, and then to you. However, being pure alone would not suffice to face the power of this Pokemon. I must test you. Are you ready? I will test how closely you've bonded with your Pokemon. I mean... Sure. <sighs> Servant Kate. You're a dragon type, right? Yep. I don't have any Pokemon left. Well, yeah, you only sent out one. If all of you only have one Pokemon, this is going to be as strong as fighting one person. Mine's witness you defeating Team Rocket when Kurt was in trouble at the slow poke well. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. These are the five different girls we saw throughout. Who we assumed was one person. I guess the main thing is you can't set up. If there were five Pokemon, if one was weak, you could, you know, set up on the first one. And then just, you know, decimate the rest of them. Um... You might be a Rock-type, maybe? Stop. Why do so many Pokemon do this to me? It's a legitimate strategy! <laughs> Alright. I should wake up this turn. Now, any chance you are... How am I still asleep? Come on. So you resist... What are you? And I'm gonna swap... Draco Meteor. Oh, you're a steel type, that's what you are. That makes sense, actually. You should probably take care of that. It's not good for your brain.
There we go. Am I finally done with you? You're quite the trainer. I remember you chasing off that Team Rocket grunt from right here. I must thank you for that. Although I'm actually a trainer myself. She who knows the most speaks the least. I am Miki, the kimono girl. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. Eh, Pokemon's not bad as it is. I dislike a lot of the choices they've made, but I still enjoy it for what it is. I didn't bother with Sword and Shield, but I did put a lot of time in Violet and Scarlet, mainly because of the multiplayer stuff. I enjoyed playing with friends. Uh, Power Whip. Nope, missed. Do I missed? I missed twice in a row. Alright, let's try for a third time. Nope, resists. Alright. So, it could be a grass type or something, so I guess I'll give the uh, old drill peck a shot. So this is the game we're playing, I see. Graphics graphics are everything. I play in 64 games all the time. Um, I have bigger issues with it like crashing and dropping me out of the game. That was a bigger issue for me. Uh, I don't like that it's less of a sign like graphics could be bad or whatever. As long as the game is good. So long as time and love and care is being put into it. There has been major issues with that and it's why I didn't put time in Sword and Shield because there was such huge issues. I'd rather just put on the, like, fanfare music in the background that played during gym battles, or whatever you called them, the stadium music, than bother playing through the entire game. Scarlet and Violet, it had some graphical things, but mainly the issues it had was it dropping me, like, literally the first time I started up, I joined someone and we dropped out. Like, within, like, 30 seconds. It was kind of lame. But we had fun, and that was the important thing, was an excuse to play a game with my friends. And that's really typically what I do. I try to find excuses to play games. It's not about fidelity to me, it's about, you know, having fun. Ow. Let's swap off. Uh Were you a grass type, maybe? I don't own a regular PS5, let alone a Pro, so that's about all you need to know about that. For those kind of people, that's what they care about, and that's fine for them. I don't, so I don't bother. I'm the last one. You are so dependable at the Goldenrod Tunnel. I'm the one who twirls even underground. I'm Cooney, the kimono girl. 
I looked at you in wonder when you thwarted Team Rocket's mission to take over the radio tower. You must show your strength to me now. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. Some people do value graphics, and that is absolutely fine. For me, it's just not what's important to me. Yeah, let's send out Togepi. Gotta get burned. Gotta get burned. Low kick. Okay. So you're probably like a flying type or something. Flying or a poison or something. I mean. Stab bonus. You're part ghost or psychic, is what the truth is. Well, not ghost. So, you're part psychic. Alright. Marsha, what are you gonna be now? Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. You're gonna be a gloom. Yay. <laughs> We are not wrong about you. You're indeed worthy of this. Please take it. The title bell. Big sisters! I just have a big shadow of a Pokemon in the World Islands waters! It could be... Melina, we'll be at the World Islands. See you there. And my mom's spending all my hard-earned, you know, money again. Goodbye! I think it'd be fun to play through the old Fatal Frame games. Um, I'm not sure when I would do that. I think that it would be something I'd probably do on stream, and rather than attempt it with my PS3 since I've had so many issues with it, I would just emulate it. I own the game, I don't care too much about it past that. I've had so many issues with my PS3 and trying to do stream stuff that it's I'll just do it at some point on stream. It's one of those horror games that I have fun with, though. Alright. Low deal. have a sunstone. No, I don't, do I? That sucks. Alright, give me just a second. So I need either a leaf or a sunstone, and I don't have either. That sucks. Ash himself did try to use an evolution stone. His big juice just was not interested. All 
All right. So I'll check out the cyan wood store. They don't have a store, right? No, actually, I don't think they have a store here. Yeah, they don't. All right. Do any of them have either Leafstone or Sunstone? Because I'd love to actually, you know, evolve my Pokemon into a new thing. While I'm here. More berries, because my mom's very silly. A muscle band. More berries. More berries. All right. Eh. I like Red. I think he's a cool dude, especially in the comics. I mean, Game Red doesn't have character. You're, it's just a vessel for you. In the same way that Game Ash from Yellow also doesn't really have any character. Yeah. So, if we're talking about actual characters, like from the anime and manga, I prefer Red. I guess technically we do see red in sun and moon and i like him there we never really see ash in game also sometimes you just you know go to the top of a mountain when somebody beats you you jump off a cliff that happened <laughs> let's go gambling ah dang it prize number three every time huh The fact that you can draw it this many times and only get prize number three. I got a netball. Okay, yeah, no, it's just those. Alright, whatever. No idea where I can find one of these. I typically drink tea. I uh, occasionally drink coffee. If I drink coffee, it's typically espresso or very occasionally drip. But drip is just kind of sadness. <laughs> yep. I wonder what you're implying, Cuppy. <laughs> With sugar, typically. Um, there are a few teas that I prefer without sugar, but most of them I'm, you know, I like it sweet. How you doing, Cup? <laughs> no, you. I think I already went to here to Olivine, but I'll try once more. Shout out to Arnie just calling up and be like, hey, you know Cuppy's favorite Pokemon? I beat the crap out of it. Bye! <laughs> Heck yeah. Getting all that good stuff. Yeah. Arnie just called me up and like, hey, I love my Wurmple. We just beat up a bay leaf. Bye. And I'm like, poor Cuppy. <laughs> because comedy.
Rodora! Yeah. I can see it. She is rocking, so I can definitely see it. The fact that HMs used to have you learn three different water type moves. You had to use up three of your slots just for water type moves. And the smart way to do things would be to not have multiple water type Pokemon. So, you'd have to use up three of your moves for water attacking moves. It's kind of dumb. Hey, Gardevoir, one of my favorites. The empathy Pokemon. Let's show it some empathy by slapping on the back. Give it a bit of insurance. Get crit on. Okay. Uh. Balboa. Adora! How you doing? I really not have... One, two, three, four, five... So, I guess it'd be HM6 that I don't have. I don't even know what that is, and I'd rather not be compared to a Nazi. No flash for me. I have no idea where I was supposed to get it.
Goodbye. I just beat up a tadpole. For reasons. Is this the same entrance I came in? No. No, because the other one had that brown rock in front. But also, it's still another entrance I could have used at any point. I forgot how slow that animation is. Remind me, does anyone remember? Do I need to go find Lugia, or can I just move on to the Pokemon League? Because Lugia isn't going to be Lugia, so I don't really 100% care. Like, a lot of the games require you to fight the box art legendary. But, am I required? I should definitely not do that. found an Everstone, just in case I never wanted my Pokemon to evolve. For reasons. Okay, so, can't even interact with that. Who do you think you are, Rocky Balboa? Get crit on. Hi, hey, Tropius. Weaves in the wind. Nothing but weaves in the wind. Oh, yeah. They're fun movies. I just double checked. I do have to fight with you. All right. Well, uh, if I'm going through with all this, then I'm actually going to fly over to the city right there, 
And I'm gonna buy a bunch of repels. Because being stopped every second by these Pokemon is just gonna take forever. Alright. And heal up while I'm here. Also, I keep forgetting that they don't have a shop here. Because they are mean like that, I guess. How dare there be a small island town. Supply me with my, uh, anti-Pokemon spray. Or else. Okay, that's just that right there. Why is there two ways back? No idea. Confusion, I guess. So there's a ladder up there. Got an escape rope. Anything in any of these? And that's the entrance I went up before. So this room is literally just an entrance room. That leads down here, which is pretty much a straight shot back to the other side. And then this one just leads right over here. So, is there a third entrance? Is that what this is? Yeah, I think there's a third entrance. Ah. So, give me messages. What I'm going to do is I'm actually going to hit the reset button because I'm just going to spawn right next to where I am. I'm also going to stretch out my legs since my knee is hurting me. So in theory, there's a third entrance somewhere. So need to figure out where that third entrance is.
Through here, maybe? Burn heal, which, eh. Pretty sure it just looped back around. Found a pearl for money. Am I at the lower island again? I think I am. If I go in the bottom left, then I might find the way out again, which is annoying. This is absolutely the other island. Yeah. Alright, so once again, we give it a quick reset. Because I'm not gaining any progress right now. I'm going to save it up with the other one. Flash was not a required thing. And as such, I never found it because I was just kind of going for it instead of playing the game like I normally would. Oh, right. Vespi Queen. I forgot I hadn't fought everyone up here. So it's like a steel type or something? Wizard? What a chad. You sleeping in? Did you know Professor Oak traveled all over the world when he was young? While traveling, he must have learned about Pokemon naturally. I envy him. I'd like to travel and learn about things too. See you later. Trying to make a mental map here, so save here. So down here, I think this is the ledges with the double jumps. It's a single item right up here. No, this is the wraparound. Yeah, so that goes down. Huh. 
I ha don't think I've looked at this in a while. Wild. So, that's the two jumps down. What's up here? Right, the one item and then the other way I can't go. And a Reaper Claw. Neat. Reaper? Aw, man. I think I just found my way out the same entrance I came in. That means there's nothing down here, right? Actually, there's a big space down here. So this must be where I need to go, I guess? New path and whatnot. Oh, hey, I found a Master Bowl. That's pretty good. There we go, I can finally see you once again. And I won't be able to anymore because I'm going back up, I guess. Okay, there's nothing else down here. Nope. Okay. That's where I got the Master Ball, so I try to go... Yeah, that just led down there, okay. I know where that is. Just looking for a way down further. Maybe this isn't the right entrance then. Pearl I found before. So the bottom left path is the only one that I found that's even slightly worth it thus far. I think this is the wrong island then, but what I will do is I will reset, grab the master ball, and then leave. It's kind of how I'm playing this right now because, once again, I very much cannot see. Up here? Yeah. All right.
I forgot how confusing the Whirl Islands were. So it might be this one right over here. I know it's one of the upper ones. I'm on my way to the world only, so I'm gonna look I'm going exploring with my friends. Wow, imagine having friends. Could never be me. In the earlier games it really was a like one man experience. You had a rival or whatever, but It's a Vulpix. Is that a grass type? You know, splash. That's a that's a move. Yeah, you were a grass type. Okay. Manaphy. The little cutie from the ocean. There's supposed to be a big Pokemon deep beneath the Whirl Islands. I wonder what it could be. Okay, this one's big. It should be this. Found the path already? Yep, I found the path. The black glasses increases dark type moves. Uh, that thing you have. You found it. Please go ahead. Suppose I should check that cave before I move on. Icy Rock. Well, that's a really nice view, actually. That's right, this is where the we welcome Wugia. When the dance we practice many days becomes one with the sound of the title bell we entrusted with you, then Wugia shall come out from deep within the waterfall basin once again. Wasn't it just seen already? So, this... Whatever. I guess this is a way to force it to come out.
That is indeed Lugia, the guardian of these islands from ancient times. So many have tried again and again only to fail. Melina, your heart is completely in harmony with the tidal bow. That is completely in harmony with the tidal bow has finally allowed it to appear. Melina, didn't you see? Lugia must have been waiting for someone like you all this time. Wouldn't you agree? Alright. Let's see what the true form of the god of the sea, Lugia, is. The true form is... That of... <laughs> A cherubi. Level 45. You know what? I don't care. I got a free master while I'm using it. This is what my legendary is. This is my legendary Lugia. It evolves by sucking the energy out of a small ball where it has been storing nutrients. Okay. This is Lugia, guys! Don't you love my Lugia? It was an epic battle, truly. They'll tell tales of that for centuries. You've done a great job. Say hello to Professor Elm for us. Yep. You have not only made Lugia appear, but you also caught it. You are so wonderful. There's nothing more for us to say. Take good care of yourself on, in your journey. Yeah. yeah. So, I'm done here, guys. No more, you know, nonsense. Oh, hey, Arnie. What do you have to say, Arnie? Melina, good morning. It's Arnie. Are you sleeping in? Hey, let's battle our Pokemon. I'm a Route 35, so let me know when you get here. Alright. Hey, Cuppy, you want me to go beat up the person who was beating up Bayleaf? <laughs> I'll go beat him up in a second. Alright, uh... Cuppy's been here just watching Warframe, or playing Warframe while watching the stream. All in lurk mode and whatnot. Good job. That egg appears to be much more rare. That wait appeared to be rare. The egg that appeared to be rare has brought you so much trouble. I guess. Come on, a girl says something about me. I don't have anything to do with it. You made up your mind yourself and went ahead with your decision. Having achieved such a thing, you should be able to take on the Pokemon League now. You should head for Indigo Plateau. Do you know how to get there? Fall Route 27 to reach Route 26. Once you get there, go straight north. Okay. Route 27 to 26 to north. Okay. Okay. I am slightly confused where 27 is. So Route 35 is here, so I can head up there in a moment.
Is this a case where... It's supposed to go this way? It is. Okay. Got it. That's why it wasn't showing up on my map. Also, look at you guys being sweethearts. Wait. I can't fly from Route 27? Why can't I fly from Route 27? It's dumb. <laughs> You guys are absolutely sweet, you know that? Who is Arnie? It's absolutely this one, right? As long as I got my bug Pokemon, it doesn't matter how long I have to wait, I know I won't get bored. Yeah. It says author Dudley, but I'm pretty sure this is Arnie. Double check. Let's see. Yep. Uh, bug catcher Arnie. That is the guy. He's supposed to have a Venonat. Alright. There we go. Vengeance for you. Vengeance for all the Bayleaf of the world. I can't sleep in my own bed. Or in my own home in general. Which is lame. Whatever. I'll be fine. I can go down here. Got it. Hey! Do you know what you just did? You've taken your first step into Kanto. Check your Poke Gear map and see. Okay. Okay! That's not the right button. That's the one. I'm in the Kanto region, technically. Jojo Falls, the link between Kanto and Jojo. Uh, power rank, I don't really care. It's useful if I was trying to make a, like, viable Pokemon or whatever. I do a bunch of training and get a bunch of EVs, but eh. Tojo Falls. Yeah. 
and let's reduce the amount of encounters we have. Not completely cut them off, but at least reduce them. Bum, 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 bum. It's a wiki tongue. I'm going to kick its butt. Do, do, do. What's with the crazy encounter? Why'd I have that crazy encounter? <laughs> okay. Whatever. Mine, Qual Fossil. Bobo is listening to the sound of the waterfall. Oh, hey, I forgot there was a cave behind the waterfall. He gets secrets. There's a radio that no longer works. Don't remember what that is. Nothing mind that one, though. It's rare to see anyone come here. Are you training on your own? Technically? I mean, I have my Pokemon with me. I think you're a grass type, so Blizzard. Ooh, that's about to hurt. Yeah. Let's just, uh, swap up to something else. Uh, yeah. Let's get jiggy with it. Fly away now, just fly away. Get crit on, kiddo. Sheer cold is terrifying. Hey, Alopity. It's a cutie pie. Goodbye, cutie pie. Oh, it actually resists. What resists ground type? Uh, maybe bug? Yep, bug. Or I guess grass type. Bug or grass, one of the two. Yeah, I get it. You're spending my savings. Oh, we're 
come true with Pokemon. Pokemon League is really enough to be win. Let me see. If it doesn't come true, some more, it could be tough going. Trust the time that binds Pokemon trainers. Uh, okay. Okay. Well, in later generations, that is absolutely true. In earlier generations, not so much. But also in later generations, it's extremely easy to get to max friendship with your Pokemon. They throw the friendship points out everywhere. So, technically, we finished the Johto region today. I wasn't sure, but I'm glad we did. Oh my gosh, it's a Flappy! <laughs> it's a cutie! Draco Meteor. Noise. Goodbye. A dread point. Okay. 